Republican governors and presidential candidates, as well as at least one Democratic governor, have responded to the attacks in Paris last week with calls to end President Obama's plan to resettle 10,000 Syrian refugees in the United States over the next year. With more on that, it's time for a closer look. So, more than half the country's governors have announced over the last couple days that they will not accept Syrian refugees in their states. But actually, the vetting process is incredibly rigorous. First, they're identified abroad. They are registered. Information is taken by the UN Refugee Agency. Then, before they can be resettled to the United States, they're interviewed one-on-one -on -one by a trained Department of Homeland Security officer. Then a barrage of checks are conducted by U.S. intelligence agencies, by the FBI, the Department of Defense, the Department of Homeland Security. There's so many steps. There are fewer steps to putting together an IKEA armoire, and that has like a million steps.